What's up everybody? Welcome back to the OG family. Make sure you smash that like button. Subscribe to my channel if you want to. Yes, I have my pet Dread here, Alfredo. But let's get into this reaction, people. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know we supporting the Code TV over here. Hopefully nothing crazy is going on. We're gonna get into this reaction. Um this channel right here is the voice of the people, and we're gonna get into this reaction. But yeah, let's see, man. Hopefully it's nothing crazy going on. Y'all know we're supporting the Code TV. Facts. Pain right now. And after this video, I'm going straight to the doctor. So Kayla, Nicole, and Ty, who were once good friends, are no longer friends anymore from my understanding because of a guy. That's his face. His name's Zay, y'all. This who Ty talked to. This her boyfriend. Now, the reason why I said their beef is over a guy because Ty new boyfriend used to be Kayla, Nicole's manager. And then when him and Ty started hooking up, Kayla fired him as her manager and unfollowed and blocked Ty on all social media platforms. So it was obvious that she was in her feelings about Ty and her manager dating. Now, Nicole was the one that introduced Ty to the manager for business. She wasn't expecting Ty to hook up with the manager. And it kind of seems like Kayla is in her feelings, not just because of business-wise, but because she might have liked the dude and wanted him for herself. That's what kind of vibes I'm getting. But until Kayla or Ty come forward and actually tell the full truth about what's going on between the three, we won't fully know what's going on, but it looks like that, okay? And after I show you the live with her talking about Ty, you gonna get the same vibes I got. Me and Deshae are still friends. Everybody, y'all think I'm friends, but still friends. Only friend I'm not friends with no more is Ty. Like, Ooh. not only did Kayla unfollow Ty, but not only did she just come out and say that though. Hey, I feel like you're real for saying that though. If 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 that is the case though, because a lot of people get this whole social media stuff misconstrued with reality. She unfollowed Deshay as well, and people noticed that she unfollowed Deshay, and she quickly put out a statement saying that her friendship online doesn't define her friendship in real life, which I call bullshit. It wasn't just about her unfollowing Deshay on social media. It was about the current events that led up to her unfollowing Deshay on social media. Now, if y'all remember back two weeks ago, I told y'all that Deshay and his girlfriend broke up. Well, after they broke up, a lot of people were suggesting that maybe he should talk to Kayla. And even Kayla seemed like she was interested in dating Deshay. She started liking comments that were saying they look like a good couple. But Deshay came and quickly shut that down, okay? He said that he didn't want to be in a relationship and that he was chilling for right now. And I think that kind of hurt Kayla feelings in a way because she was hoping that maybe her and Deshay could see how things work out before you shut it down. But I can understand where Deshay is coming from. He just got out of relationship before Fact. that he was in another relationship so it just seems like he's just hopping from one girl to another girl but you can tell that it was hey he's still young too as well when y'all young bro date do what you're gonna do but also take breaks too real shit take breaks man to really figure it out if you don't take breaks to really figure yourself out then yo when you get there to where you're trying to get to in your life and the feeling that you really feel like you're being yourself and you just you you all understand it when y'all get there but look I feel like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? He's doing the right thing, though. That's very mature of him. Real was shit. was affecting Kayla because they stopped hanging out, and that's when she started hanging out with Ty more. Now, even though she said in the video that her and Deshae are still friends, I'm pretty sure they had a conversation. They squashed whatever problem that they had between each other because Deshae is that type of person. If something happens, he always try to quickly resolve it before it gets ugly. But people did that. notice that Kayla yeah. unfollowed Deshae. Now, here's what Kayla had to say about Deshae and Ty. I was... Ooh, I was so drained emotionally, work, then with these toxic re friendships, relations, whatever. It just all got to me because I'm just like, damn, that on top of that and then that. So, but yeah, so I just, I just, I just, I just now saw that Shade Room post. Um, I didn't know somebody was going to record that live, but I mean, yeah, obviously. We're not friends anymore. Um, I can't. I'm blocked on Instagram until tomorrow. I can't like or comment. So that's that's why y'all haven't saw me interacting. And I've been posting pictures with no caption. Because I can't, goddamn it. I fucking can't say what I got to say. I got to keep constantly hopping on live. Like, but, but yeah, so... Oh, let me tell y'all real that shit. Yeah, that shit's so stupid, bro. Like, I don't, bro, she be doing that shit. That shit's stupid. It's funny. <laughs> I got these damn shades because I thought people couldn't really see who I was. Ever since I got these hoes, every time I walk somewhere, they be like, when somebody see me, they be like, did you think them glasses? <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, yes, I did. That's why I got them. <laughs> but, yeah, so, um, I'll just pop 
Dog, she ain't just do that shit. Yeah. She ain't to do that shit. But no, honestly. Bro, stop with the Nicole. Stop with the fucking braid. Like that, that joint get me every time, bro. Like stop it, bro. Like, nigga. Y'all yeah, wanna know what happened? Yeah, we wanna know. Read in the comments. Y'all done pretty much figured it out without me. I didn't. Let me know. Without me just clarifying anything. Um, I ain't gonna go into detail. Don't, just, just let me know. Cause I don't wanna be the person that comes to the internet about it, but I know people kept speculating, kept asking all these questions, and I'm like, damn. This is not about the shade or anybody else. Like, what the fuck? Right now, I only follow family and fan pages. Like, that's it. But I had to go off because I'm just... So, so Nicole, like, real talk, you even... Hey, man, you're a real one. You comment on my videos and stuff like that, bro. We in a community together. If I followed you, you wouldn't follow me back? I'm so hurt right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, that you you would have that mentality that you wouldn't even... You wouldn't... You wouldn't even... Like, like, you wouldn't even like. Like, she wouldn't even follow me back. Like, it's okay, though. You know what I'm saying? You could do that, too. I can do it, too. But, now that's crazy, though. Follow me it's back, like, nigga. Stop bitch, playing. Bitch, no. This ain't about my nigga. Like, that's my role, though. Like, the fuck? Don't do that. But, and it wasn't about her, either. Okay. I just said that because I keep seeing, like, um, people's, like, how do you think, how do y'all feel about following or unfollowing friendship? Then I saw... Bad baby said something, and it was like, some, she was like, she I something. feel, I, I, I don't even follow people I fuck with on a day-to-day -day basis. I was like, I feel the same way. Like, it's not as serious to me. Like, people just kept having this debate. So I was like, shit, I just feel like a follow-up. Hold on, people that you fuck with on the, hey, I, 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 it's, it's, it's levels to this, though. I guess I ain't there in my life where I can't fuck with people that I, you know, I don't follow people that I don't mess with on my daily day. That That's crazy to me. Because people that I mess with on my day to day, yes, I'm more inclined to follow you. And I want to see what you're doing during your day than somebody that I don't mess with. So, if you're my friend and you don't follow people that you don't follow on your day to day, that's cool. But if you follow people that you don't, now I got a problem. I follow that don't. Y'all could be fucking on the richest nigga right now and y'all wouldn't know trying to look through some followers like that's like it's just the, i feel you on that it's like every industry person you meet yeah. or something like that you don't have to follow them Fact. just because y'all friends but <clears throat> i mean y'all was right about what the fuck y'all was saying but i ain't fighting i ain't gonna say that <laughs> um i'm just here to answer more questions just because um i don't want people thinking the wrong thing that's why i hopped on live the first time i'm not right. friends with her nor was I friends with my former manager. That's not my manager currently. Um, Y'all see the six-figure page. So I see a lot of pages addressing him as my manager. So my manager anymore. Um, his name is Zay. Yeah, that's my best friend name, Zay. Zay. You out here fuck... Ah, oh, man. All right, cool. So I'm not manager anymore. Just to put that out there. Um, oh, she big mad. Him and his new met through me. Oh, she yeah. big mad. It wasn't supposed to be like that. What the fuck? I know ain't nobody on my damn roof. Or is that squirrels? Like, what the hell? That shit is creeping me out. Um. Who's Kentravion? Somebody said Kentravion on here. <laughs> what? That's a YouTuber? Who the fuck is Kentravion? Bro. I ain't trying to be funny. If you name your kid that, go ahead. Jump off a bridge. Head first. Doesn't mean nothing. What you mean? Oh shit. <laughs> hey, boss man. Hey, Polo. I hear that too. I swear to God, I thought I was tripping. Look, but they've been doing that all day. Like, squirrels be all up in a tree. And they'll be, like, throwing shit at the house. Like, do y'all want to fight about something? Like, I'll cut the whole fucking tree down. And be there, everybody is. Put your hair up until I'm dying. 
Y'all, what should I be for Halloween? Halloween is like after tomorrow. I can't be myself. Cause my I got these cornrows. Why am I doing this? Like people get on live and do I'm waiting for her to say something else, you know what I'm saying? We just sitting here watching, she rambling, like I wanna know motherfucker spill the tea, first of all. Do tell, do tell if you're gonna be on here saying something. Like, do tell, you know? Dumb shit. Like, come on, girl, stop all this. But yeah, you just girl, fuck you. Don't put, she put, um, she put the glasses on. I'm not gonna be the first to speak on it. Unless, unless they want me to. If they wanna clear it up, address it up. If anybody offended by a certain rumors, then I'll fix it. Like, well. We have an ad. This is what really happened. Um, but I'm going to talk to him. I sent him the post, so I'm actually going to text him. or just tell him to come here. Since everybody getting the clap they want it. Let him have it. Uh, yes. Okay? I'm good. Be a snake. I don't like a snake. Oh, 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 oh. But let me talk my shit about this real quick. This young fanatic person, don't fucking, don't tag me in that shit. If you do the dance to his song, I don't got nothing to do with that. That little boy keep trying to take my shit and make it seem like his. I didn't know about this whole original, this Brazilian song called, I don't know what the fuck it's called, but it said move like a snake once or twice. That shit happened in 2018. Didn't know nothing about it, but don't tag me in that. Move like a snake. Move like a snake. I don't want to hit it. Don't take me in that shit. Cause I'm gonna beat that bitch ass. Like he. Oh, she gonna pull up. Don't don't fucking tag me in that and don't hashtag that. <laughs> Y'all finna move like a snake. I was like, that don't got none of that. Is not a fuck ass thing to do with that. That's my shit, okay? And I'm gonna go ahead and drop the little song because I don't have time to be waiting on no fucking like no. So I'm gonna put that shit out. I just been trying to see what I was gonna do with it. Cause I actually came out with some merch to match the little new like snake thing. And that's what's really been taking me so long. I'm like, yeah. Hey, don't let that little motherfucker take your motherfucking shine on that though. For real, for real. Like you come out with that move like a motherfucking snake. Don't let him do that. Like facts. Let's get it. Don't do that shit. Don't move like a snake. Ooh, she, oh shit, my ride outside. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'll fight somebody else. Alright, yo, so she out though, but y'all gotta think though, man. Look. That for me, for real, for real, that don't seem like it's something super major though. That don't seem like it's something super major. Uh, That seems something slight to me. That ain't. That's not a bad thing. You know what I'm saying? The stuff that she's going through right now, that's not a bad thing, man. So, I feel like that all of this stuff right here, man, it can be solved over a conversation that it can have a guy because it's something that's so true. It's something that is, 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 is not that serious. It's definitely not that serious. But, man, hopefully they come to a resolution with this because, you know what I'm saying, both part, I mean, it's just, it ain't, it ain't worth it at the end of the day. Especially if it's over a dude. If it's over a dude, like the same thing. If it was two dudes and they was talking about it, it was over a girl, bro. That shit ain't worth it. Real talk. You know what I'm saying? Like, and y'all young. Live life, man. Y'all still young, man. Get out here. Date. Talk to people. And then this nigga fucking hairline is like this big already. So, but it is what it is, bro. Spread love because too much hate in this world, man. I'll see y'all in the next video. I love y'all. I'm out, though. Facts.